a bit messy in here. Just a quick tip that I got on Instagram for a free bed for your van. We're in the middle of Hamburg right now and I'm sitting in this van and it's a little bit too warm in here um, to be not having the doors open but I want to have the better sound quality. I want to tell you about a free bed idea for your van and it's awesome because it's free. Just excuse the mess here because you know we're in the middle of building and we're just finishing the, off the side panels of this standard wood as you can see um, but we're gonna paint it so that it looks a little bit better. Um, let me just show you what's really interesting right now for you which is what does the bed look like and where can I get it? Well I can tell you already because you can get the bed second hand everywhere like in Germany here it would be on eBay um, where you can get stuff second hand very easily I don't know what it's gonna be in your country but almost every country has an IKEA and that is the brand of the bed and so this bed has probably been bought so many times that everyone is just sick of it and wants to sell it or wants to give it away for free that's the case in Germany at least hopefully it's the same for you and your country because that means you can get a free bed let me just show you what it looks like so this is the bed doesn't it look awesome? Ugh. Let me just tell you a couple of facts here. The original bed of IKEA, which is called Beddinger, is 2 meters long and 140 in width. And that is it. You get an aluminium frame with wooden boards. Um, yeah, the mattress we bought on top. So we spent money for this mattress, but we did not spend any money for the frame, which was important. You can get the whole bed for free. So you get the frame and you get the mattress. So you wouldn't have to spend anything really. Anyways, let me get this mattress off so you can see better. Okay. That's a bit better, isn't it? We've already put in the lights, which is awesome, so you can see better. We got the aluminium frame. We've got the wooden bars in between and those small little plastic you know holders are even labeled for what plastic it is so you gotta just love this one probably the best thing about this bed is that you don't need anything to hold this little frame here with the mattress on it's even better you can't really lay on these ones because they might break but this one is just carrying all the way ouch and everything that is holding this frame is this small angular piece of metal you know like I've bolted the angle whatever it's called in the sides of the van and just I had to put this bit of wood in between because I bought I bought one which is too small so I had to put a bit of wood in between so that this still lays on it and I put this one in between so that it just makes for more even weight distribution from the top so that's everything. You just need a couple of angles on the sides and your bed is ready. There's one thing you will have to do up front though, because this IKEA bedding, um, couch, sofa, bed, whatever you want to call it, um, is actually two meters long. And you will have to cut off the sides of it, which is, uh, I think, four pieces of aluminium, if I remember it correctly. Um, I've got a video on when we did. Um, so yeah, that's everything. Um, as you can see, it is super sturdy and it is just a very nice tip that I got on Instagram from a dude. Shout out to him. I'm going to link his Instagram below. If you want to know more tips of him, just send him a DM. Otherwise, uh, follow me for, or just let me know what tips you got. I can't really, like, I'm not that heavy, you know, like, of course, it, it's not going to move if I do anything here. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put the mattress back on and yeah